When mounting the cables in the actuator, start loosening the Torx screw and take it out. Then move the cover slightly down the outer tube. When this is done, remove both plugs from the holes and install the cables. Then move the cover back in place and clamp the Torx screw again. When mounting the cables in the WCU basic control, start by ensuring that 5 to 7 centimeters of the cables are stripped so that the different conductors can be moved sufficiently. You have a 2 core motor cable. Here you must use both wires. You have a 6 core signal cable. Here you must use the red, the black, and the purple. Cut off the rest. When mounting the cables, insert them in the respective gland nut and tighten it. Then mount the wires in the following terminals. Blue in terminal 3. Brown in terminal 4. Red in terminal 5. Purple in Terminal 6. Black in Terminal 8. When the cables are mounted correctly, take out the shielding at the fuse holder. Then mount the 230 volt cable for the supply. Insert the shielding again. You have now connected the control to the supply and the actuator.